Hello YouTube, this is Asatsu5 and today I'm reviewing the X-Star Parliament wallet. It has been nicknamed the James Bond wallet, something that you would find from Q Branch. That's why the PPK is here, because it's not only cool, but it's James Bond related. So I thought I'd put it in the um, background. Um, I've showed this in some EDC updates, I believe. It's my wallet that I'm using as of right now. I'm always on the search for the perfect wallet. This one is fun. I don't know if it's perfect, but I really enjoyed it. And for those of you who don't know, you have this little trigger right here, and it um, ejects some of your cards out. Uh, or it doesn't really eject them, but it kind of fans them out where you could uh, choose the desired card. And, um, you know, you can choose the card that you want and put it back in and that's kind of just the cool factor of it is that it slings them out. Now it holds uh, anywhere from um, four to six wallets I believe, oh not wallets but cards um, in the um, um, basically the little um, um, case right there, there's a metal case right there and um, depending on um, how many cards you have, if they're embroidered or not, and basically embroidered it is if, if it has the raised lettering on it, um, you can, um, uh, they'll eject a little bit better, and um, it d really de it depends on if they're embroidered or not, how many cards you can actually fit in this uh, metal ca housing. Um, then you got a card holder right here, which I keep a key card in, and some other stuff. Hey, look, a dollar. Uh, I didn't know I had that dollar. And then it has a back um, uh, pocket. And what I keep in that back pocket, let's see if I can get it out, is this uh, tracker. And let's see, I need to look up the name of this tracker because um, I hardly think about it. Uh, it's the uh, Chipolo um, tracker. Um, ring to find my, uh, to find... See, it, it rings, and you have like a little map, um, so if you lose your wallet, this is in your wallet, and you lose it, uh, and it's connected, because if you um, exit out of uh, that tracking app uh, while your um, f phone's on, it's no longer tra keeping up with the uh, uh, wallet, so you really need to... Uh, <clears throat> Connect it and see it's connecting now. It's connected and it'll keep up with your wallet. And for some of you, some of you may know that I've been having memory problems and I've attributed this to aspartame. I've been drinking a lot of diet sodas and um, it's been um, it's, it's been kind of uh, wearing on my memory and it's been noticeable by uh, friends and family. Uh, obviously, I'm forgetting, so I don't know that there was an issue, but uh, it's been pointed out to me that I've been forgetting stuff that I shouldn't forget. So that's why I got the little tracker. Now, um, um, this is kind of a minimalist wallet, but it is thick. Um, you know, you could hold roughly 10 cards in it all together. Then you got a cash strap right here to hold your cash. Uh, keep in mind, uh, if you have this stacked up with a bunch of bills or banknotes, it's going to be kind of like that, not completely closed. Some of you might find that uh, annoying. But I really enjoyed this wallet. I love this burgundy color. And it comes with many other colors. Um, you can either get this directly from Xstar with this tell a friend 10% um, off um, coupon code. You can use that. I don't think it, I've, I've shown it to a couple other people. But I don't know if um, if it's been used up or if it has a limit. But you can try that from the um, website. Or you can go on Amazon and get it. And um, it costs $89. I have links in the description of um, uh, where you can get this. And you can buy this uh, tracker as an add-on. Uh, which I think is around 50 bucks. I know it's pretty expensive, but you got real leather. Um, you got a cool little mechanism to fan that stuff out uh, to get get what you want out, and then you can put it back in there, ready to go. 
and um, I think it's a pretty classy wallet. I've been enjoying it. Uh, it's a little bit thinner than a, a trifold, but it's a thicker than a bifold. Um, and it's just been really cool. I've used the tracker on it once, um, which, um, uh, you know, I didn't like lose it, um, you know, where I needed the map, but I was able to push the ringer and find my wallet, which is a good thing that I was able to do that. And um, so it's just kind of a cool little item. And uh, it always makes me feel special when I go up to the cash register or go like that, you know, do the car thing. Uh, the thing that kind of bum bums me out a little bit, it can't hold as much cash. I'm a cash person. It helps me to stay uh, financially um, knowledgeable when I use cash. And there's not a whole lot of uh, storage for a lot of different cars. Uh, I no longer have it, but I usually use a Mighty Wallet. Not very classy, but it is probably the ultimate minimalist wallet. Not because it's minimalist, because you can put you can stack it up until it's like that thick. But it is self-adjusting, so you can put as much stuff as you want in it, and it'll be like that thick. Or you can um, take everything out, and it'll be paper thin because it's literally made out of paper. But um, this has made me feel a little bit more special, and I think it goes well with the PPK. Even though people who are, are I'm buying stuff from will never see the PPK, hopefully, I just feel that you know it just kind of has a cool factor, kind of like the PPK. So, oh yeah, and um, um, the harder you press the trigger, the harder the uh, cards come out. And if you shoot it forward real quickly and press the target, the cards can fall out. But in general, uh, this one uh, is a lot better than the cheaper ones you find on Amazon that have the same mechanism. Because uh, you're not going to just... Uh, press the trigger and then they shoot out some of the other ones you press the trigger real hard the cards shoot out But this one you have to actually have some momentum behind it in order for the cards to come out So that's it. That's the review. I'm a Satsu 5 and I'm out